blast off. Lucha, Lucha, Lucha. Oh. <laughs> Lucha Underground is back with another episode. And we're kicking off with the Lucha Underground World Champion. With the Lucha in the middle champion, Phoenix. And the, <laughs> the fallen contenders of Mumates and Christopher Daniels. Yeah, so these lot are just coming out. They're like, oi, I'm better than you. No, I'm better than you. Oh, I'm better than you. Oh, I'm better than you. Me, 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 me. And then, holla, holla, players. <laughs> We're going to have ourselves a tag team match. <laughs> We're going to have Pentagon and Will Martez, the Hills versus Phoenix and Christopher Daniels at the main event. You didn't it's even realise Theodore Long was here. Yeah, mate. It, mate, in due time, we got to sign him, mate. <laughs> Worker improvement. Literally, yeah. just to say that. <laughs> I didn't actually think this was going to get as good rain because we, nah, like, we were told they couldn't crap. speak English. Yeah. This yeah, angle probably. got the shaft to a strong stop. This angle got right. the crowd hotter. That's right. Pentagon Dark is improving in acting. Oh, that's good. good. And there was a few negatives. Yeah, yeah, there was language problems for a few of them. Not too bad, though. Yeah, thank God. That's... So, who is it? Pentagon Dark? Phoenix and Wolf Arthur, Phoenix, they've all got few, yeah. they've got to learn English, mate, what are they doing? I know, they're, they're in fucking Ameng, America, what the fuck? Yeah, next, mate. Beep, 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 beep. 61. Wow, that's a bloody <laughs> And they've got that good wrestling and a decent reaction. Joey DePito Ryan defeated Aerostar in 609, nearly 619. Yeah. <laughs> but then with a kid that you read, bro. I forgot that was his finisher. <laughs> I feel like we, we shouldn't be burying Aerostar like this. He's I know. Got, he, he, he did better range. than Joey Ryan. <laughs> yeah. A lot, lot better. And we always take the piss out of him. <laughs> yeah. Mate, what a match. Great match to start. What's the work improvements? This was just a match to give jo Joey the win. Technical skills, well, good for him. That's nice. What's the dirt sheet? There was only two negatives. That's good. Content and, uh, risk being low, for fuck's sake. And the announcing quality, that's going to take time. Of yeah. Eventually, uh, develop. Fucking oh, hell. Oh, oh, and the man with a freaking broken neck. No, it's Saber not. Tooth Jr. It's not, Kurt, yes, it's not Kurt Angle. It's even better. It's... Saber Tooth Jr. <laughs> Why am I saying it in, like, hillbilly? He's not even American. He's any... Anyway, he just comes out and runs Joey Ryan away. And Joey Ryan's like, oh, wait, bro, leave me alone. Joey Ryan's like, your wife is next. No, <laughs> no mate. Look at his name. It's not his wife is next. Your kids are next, mate. <laughs> <laughs> poor gimmick. Oh, shit. It was Ben last for a poor gimmick. Mate, oh, well. Oops. It's a shame. Oh, oh man. mate. <laughs> look at these two animals. Look at, look at their little circle heads, mate. <laughs> They're just going at it, punt. It's like <laughs> sheep, sheep punching each other, mate. They're not even pretend punching. They're actually punching each other. Yeah. Both of them have broken noses. They're bleeding everywhere. Like they're legit in hating each they other. They fall like, out the ring, you know. Mate, they're backstage. They're in the ring, you nutter. Yeah, that's true. They're yeah. they're backstage. Who, who said they were in the ring? <laughs> yeah. <I'm not> sure. <laughs> Analyze for be... low morale. Oh, that would only so sixty eight. This show's going well, good. Oh, then Big Daddy Kev and Scott and Hall. Scott Hall. And like, yo, brother, brother dude. Uh, they're, they're, they're talking about a possible future signing of Hulkamania. Hulk Hogan. Then... <laughs> anyway, they're like... Brother. They're like, oh, look, we showed all of you. We beat that bitch, Mr. Blobby. Oh, he was... We are easy. Two on one. So poor Mr. Blobby's getting ousted. But Mr. Blobby isn't out there. He's off screen. So anyway, then we... What's handle changes? Oh, better charisma for Big Daddy Kev. Handle changes, mate. What? What? The bottom, mate. This is what I've got to put up with, ladies. Yeah. Gentlemen. Oh, no, wait, wait. Close, close. Spoilers. Oops. Oh, now, now they know Mr. Blobby. Mr. Blobby's meant to be face. We just turned him face. Next. <laughs> oh. <laughs> to be fair, considering they didn't click, that's not... Awful. In an extremely yeah. short match, Big Daddy Kev defeated Cage in 426 by pinfall with a jackknife powerbomb. Cage took a stump bump. They don't click. Scott Hall's at the announcer desk. He's just talking about how great Big Daddy Kev is. Cage with a 53. Big Daddy Kev 45. It's lost the heat in the story. This had to be a... Oh, God. It's my phone. Sorry. That had to be a car crash. So yeah. Let's get that out of the way. 
there's loads of bat negatives, but there's not too many. Not as many as I thought for a 58 year old man. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. I was about to say he's nearly dead, mate. <laughs> You're probably not even allowed to wrestle at that age anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's good. Jesus. And they're about to add superb wrestling and great heat. Christopher Daniels and Phoenix defeated Mil Muertes and Pentagon Dark in 1950 when Christopher Daniels defeated Mil Muertes with, by pinfall with their last rights. Phoenix took a stunt bump during the match. Mil Muertes was slowed by injury somewhat. Pentagon Dark took a stunt bump. Phoenix got 74. No Daniels, joke. 59. Pentagon so Dark, 78. Absolutely. Mil Martes, 56. Not so much. But Mil Martes was Game injured, heat. so you know. Yeah. What a match. Dirt sheet, loads Boys. of shit. Oh my god, look, if the Phoenix Mil Martes storyline had better heat, mate, we could be looking at about 73, 74. I know, it's crazy. And, we, mate, aren't we too good? Ain't I know that... what's going on. It's mainly you who do does the planning, though, so... <laughs> <laughs> I can't even take any credit for for any of it. Hey, we get ideas. We come up with ideas together. Yeah. Like, submit them. Oh no! What do you mean, Nana? Because we got penalised because there weren't enough attractive women. We could have got oh, yeah. a higher rating if we had done that. Oops. Anyway, sixty four is really good. Yeah. To put that in perspective. Smackdown that just happened got a seventy eight, so only fourteen better, and they've got freaking like Seth Rollins. And, and it was well, still Seth Rollins, and then get a better rating. Yeah, mate. Anyway, thanks for tuning in. Yeah, see you later. Slaters. <laughs>